Currently, we're working with blogs, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can customize the global settings of your blog posts to ensure that every post is designed exactly the way you want it to appear throughout your site. Let's click to blog on the left here, and here under manage posts, let's actually click into this first sample post. Now inside here, as you might imagine, we have all of the imagery and text assets associated with this specific blog post that we're free to edit. We've got our header text, our hero image, and all of the text serving the meat of our blog. But now let's look underneath all of this and see what we find. We have some additional assets that seem to be grayed out. We have some share buttons, we have a Facebook commenting feature, and we have other related blogs listed here that are previewed and linked below. Now I want to point out something here on the top of the page. We see up here on the top right an indication of post mode. And what that means is we are currently sitting on a page that allows us to edit an individual post, which makes sense since what we clicked on before this was an individual post. However, there is another mode to pay attention to, and that's called layout mode. Layout mode is where you can make changes to global settings that appear on every blog of your site. So like we see down here, sharing buttons, comment features, links to other blogs, these are all things that we would theoretically want to appear on every blog of our site. And layout mode gives you the opportunity to configure this one time, instead of having to implement this every single time you make a new blog post. So how do we get there? Well, let's click back into blog here on the left, and let's click here to edit layout. And there we go. Now here on the top right, we can see that layout mode is indicated, letting us know that we're in the right place. Now here on this page, we can style up the foundation, the skeleton of what each blog is going to look like, which will save you a ton of time. And this can be edited any time down the line as well. Even if you have 100 blogs already posted, if you decide later that, let's say, you no longer want this commenting feature, or you want to change the shareable links displayed, make that change once in layout mode here, and it will be immediately reflected in all blog posts currently sitting on your site. As we scroll through the page, you'll notice that the styling freedom looks pretty identical to what you might see when designing a regular page and without code. You've got rows that you can edit and customize, you can grab widgets from the widgets library, you can resize things, literally anything you want to do. Say you wanted to add a blog search function here above the list of related blogs. Well, we can go into the widgets panel, scroll down to blog, grab a search posts widget, and drop it into a new row on our page just like that. Let's click done. And now let's click back to that first blog post we looked at earlier. We see our main blog content and if we scroll down, now shown in the grayed out section is a search bar just like we configured in layout mode. 